Hello my little butterflies, in this video is going to just be me, um, I guess a movie review for 13 Reasons Why. Y'all, I just watched 13th Reason Why on Netflix in less than 24 hours. I started last night, well yesterday evening, really, because it was maybe a little bit after 5 when I started. I finished today, a few hours ago, like maybe 2 hours ago. Y'all, this movie was so good. Okay, so this is my first movie review. And it's more of a discussion than a movie review, really. Um, but I love this freaking movie. I have never read the book, so I don't know what the book is about. But um, everybody was talking about this movie was shit. I don't know, we watched like two different movies because I really enjoyed this movie. Maybe, I don't know if I read the book first, it would have changed my perception on the movie, but I love this movie, okay? Because I have heard a few people say that they didn't like the movie, they hated the movie, don't even look at the movie, just read the book. I enjoyed this movie. Now, don't get me wrong, I almost cried like twice doing this movie. Like, I teared up, but I didn't cry. Um, one of the times was at the end when they actually showed the scene of her slitting her wrist um, in the tub. I wasn't expecting that. I was like, oh my God. Like, I was really, like, sitting in the bed, getting ready to cry. I was like, oh my Jesus, no. I didn't know that it was going to, like, make a scene for that. And I was like, oh my God. Like, I was, I was ready to cry. I think the scene when um, Marcus tried to put his hand, like, up her skirt. And I was like, why? Like, and he, like, he was just such a dick about it. And she started crying, and it made me want to start crying. And I was just like, oh my Jesus, like, oh my God. Like, girl, you're gonna make me cry. Like, this is really emotional. It's up three, up to almost three this morning. And I had to make myself go to sleep because I had an interview this morning. That's why I'm like, dressed up like this. Um, but yeah. I want to know, which this movie did not answer for me. Why the hell did Tyler have all of those guns? Like, is he planning to like, go shoot up the school or something? Cause he just so pissed with everybody. Why the hell did he have all these guns? Like, he about to go to war with somebody. That question was not answered. So, um, what are they gonna do with that? Like, it's 13 Reason Why it's supposed to be like a book series? I thought it was supposed to be just like a single book. Okay, I thought it was supposed to be a standalone. But if it's supposed to be a series, I mean, I'm ready for more because I want to know why the hell he got all the bullets and stuff. It's like, and his parents don't know about this. Like, <sighs> this movie was just really good all around. I really did enjoy this movie. I gave this movie a 5 out of 5 stars if I had to rate it out of stars. I gave this movie an 8 freaking plus. If I had to rate it, you know, grayscale wise, it was freaking good. I love this book. I mean, this movie. <laughs> I guess I don't even know if I want to go read the book now because I don't want it to change my perception of the movie and make me feel like the book was better or feel like oh, this book sucks because I like the movie better. So I don't know if I'm going to read the book. I used to want to, but I think I want to read it just to see. Do you guys know the book go into detail about Tyler with the guns or is that just something that they added, you know, for the movie? Because. That looks like something I'd be very interested to see about, you know? And, oh my God, when they showed the scene of, oh, it's a male, a 17-year-old male shot in the head, gunshot wound, I was like, oh my God, who is it? Because Tyler had a gun and freaking, um, what was his name? I can't remember his name. The douchebag that um, had that that was first on the list that, that took a picture of her under her skirt and said he hit it. Him. They had, both of them had guns. Then the other one, um... Alex, his dad's a police officer, so he has guns. And then also, and I was just like, oh my god, who was it that shot themselves? And when they're going to the fitness video, I was calling people up here he showed up, it can't be him. He showed up, it can't be him. I was seeing him, so it was, I was like, oh my freaking god, who did it? And I couldn't believe what it was. Like, I could not believe that. But oh my god, y'all, this movie was good. I really enjoyed it. I, I damn near binge, you might as well say I binge watched it. It's like, if I didn't have an interview this morning, I probably would have watched it all freaking morning. Like, this movie was so good. I really enjoyed it. So, yeah, that's all I have for this video. I don't really have much else to say that this video was good. I really did this video to ask questions about Tyler and all the goddamn guns that he had. And if this is, like, supposed to be, like, a standalone or, or they're just going to, like, make the TV show into more of a series or what. But I was just so emotional watching this. I'm just, like, I'm so done, yo. <laughs> oh, my God. Netflix took over my life yesterday and today. So I think I'm about to go watch more Netflix to be honest with y'all. I done just started this Netflix binge and I should be finishing these books that I have started. <sighs> but yeah, I'm not going to force myself if my body feels like Netflix and that's what we're going to have to do. So um, yeah, that's all I have for this video. Thank you guys for sticking in there. Don't forget to like, 
share and subscribe and i will see you guys later bye